We're going to use magnetics to show how we can see multiplication work. So I'm giving Tazwa Rashid Ridwan. Hi, Tazwa. Please introduce yourself. You have food in your mouth, but that's okay. Hi. Don't say my yucky food that I'm showing. Oh, you want to see yucky food. Okay, but he's Tazwa Rashid Ridwan. He's in kindergarten one. Hi. Aren't you in kindergarten one? Kindergarten are for babies. KG one? Oh, okay. KG one. <laughs> All right, we're so... We're going to this to the TV, everyone. Yes, we're going to go give it on YouTube, right? Okay, so um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to give Tazwar to split up 24 into 3 times, 4 times, 2 dimensions. And he's going to use the magnetics to actually do this uh, splitting up of 24 using magnetics in different dimensions. Okay, so he has 24 here. Let's see how he can do that. Okay, here's three, as Papa said, then comes four line waves. One, two, and then I, three, four. See, now I will get one here and another here. See, as Papa told me, I did it. See, almost did it. Now you have to show, you have to calculate. How many are you calculating so far? It's mm. Show the x-axis and the y-axis and the z-axis. The x-axis is this way and this way. Right. The y-axis is this way and and this way. The z-axis is this way. Yes, yeah, so you don't have a z-axis yet, right? Yes. So make the z-axis. So which one are you considering the x in your 3 times 4 times 2? You can do any one as x and y or z. Just wait. Now I'll give another one of it. Okay. Let's see if it works. So if you're giving another one of it, which axis are you expanding? Which axis? Mm hmm so you said you have an Z axis. Z axis, okay, great. So you said you already have the X and Y axis, now you're expanding on the Z axis. Now, I'll give another of this. Right? Mm hmm. How many? Ah, so how many much, how much more did you expand on the Z axis? One. You expanded one more, so now you have. Can you multiply again and see how many you have here? Okay, yes. let's see. Four, three, twelve. Okay, twelve multiplied with four. Mm -hmm. Four times four. Eight. Eight. I think that's wrong. I think it's like. This. So you multiply the x-axis first with the y-axis. Mm -hmm. Which one is your x-axis again? What? Which one is your x-axis? These two ways. Right, so multiple, so see how many do you have on your x-axis. You have, look, you have... You one, said, two. No, x-axis, which way are you considering x-axis? This, this way? How many are here? One, two, three, four, right? One, two, three, four, okay. No, but this is your z-axis. Mm -hmm. you're, you're not going to count the x-axis again. You're going to count it only one time, right? So you count 1, 2, 3, 4 in your x-axis. On your z-axis you have 1, 2. So that's 4 times 2 is 8. Right? And what do you have on your z-axis? Uh, y-axis. 1, 2, 3. So how many are here already? Uh, okay, tell me. Again. In your x-axis you have 1, 2, 3, 4. In your y-axis you have 1, 2, 3. So 4 times 3. 12. 12. And in your z-axis you have 1, 2. So that will make 12 times 2. This? 24. 24. So we've completed that. The only thing that we didn't really, we need to arrange this here and first put the x-axis so you said your x-axis is 4 then can you write which one was your y-axis and your z-axis from here from this structure that you made just write your y-axis and z-axis
You wrote your, you saw your four. The numbers of it? Yeah. Okay, so okay, okay. I can, I can do it. And put multiplication in between, okay? So four, I've already written for you the x-axis. Oh, you want to write a new one? X goes in four, right? Right? Okay, so you got to give x equals four. You say x equals four, okay? Okay. Then, what do you have to say? Y equals... Hey! Y equals give an equal sign. Y equals see from here. What is your Y? Three. Oh, great! You know it already. Okay. What's your Z? My Z is equal to two. Two. Great. Now, what have we done here? We have multiplied x times. Y times Z. Yeah. Right? Yeah. So you multiply the numbers. I just wrote you the multiplication of the axes. So you put the numbers and multiply. So I put the numbers. Papa, what's this? X times Y times Z. So you, what is your X? Write the number there. My X is 4. 4 times, what is your Y? My Y is three. Twenty-four. Hey, do, 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 do. Ah, you figured out, huh? You figured it out. Equals. Oh, wow. Would you look at that? So, the last thing that I want to tell you is, we had 24 initially. Yes. What we did was, we split up the 24 into three dimensions. If this is your X, this is your Z, Y, and this is your Z, how did we split it up? We put, how, many, how much did we put in X? <coughs> you have it here. Four. Four. How much did we put in Y? Can you write it down? How yeah, 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 yeah. I can write it down. <coughs> Don't tell me anything. I'm not Don't give me clues. I'm not giving you clues. <coughs> and... Great. So that's how you can split up numbers into dimensions. Get that idea? Now can you show me a dimension in this room? Do you see an x-axis in this room? I think so. I think it's the place. This floor? Yes, I have this wrap paper, right? So look, I can see the x-axis everywhere. See? Where is your y-axis? My y-axis is like this. And where is your Z axis in this room? My Z axis is up and Z. You see the wall going up? Yeah? Yeah. That's the Z axis. Cool, huh? So if I told you, Tazo, can you split up the number 24 in the floor? You could have done that. Couldn't you have split up the 24 in your X axis 4? Yes. And then your Y axis 3? Yes. And then your Z axis 2? Yes. Yes. That's yes. Now let me tell yes. you. Now let me tell you one yes. thing. That's how engineers make buildings. Well, I'm an engineer, and I can make a stronger building than any engineer. Watch me. Okay. Hey, what do we do? Okay. Now we you say bye bye to everyone. No, no, no. It's not. We'll do another one. We'll do another one. But if it's too long, we can't put it on YouTube. You have to say bye bye to everyone. It's, if it's too long, we can't put it on YouTube. Come on, quickly, you have to say bye-bye. Okay, bye-bye, bye-bye. Peace. Say, say, see you all again. We'll see you all again, but this is a fun thing that I wanted to show you.